Hey guys, Cryptic Grifter here and welcome back to the next episode in the series The Golf Club. What I'm going to do in this particular video is I'm going to play a round on a course that was recommended to me by Kenny Harrison who left a comment on one of my recent videos. And the first course that I'm going to play that he recommended um, is Stone Hollow on Yeti River. But that one I'm not going to play because I've already played that one with... Um, some of uh, some of my friends online so I'm going to go straight into Seven Lakes on the Vale Golf Club so let's see if I can find that one Seven Lakes okay so I couldn't find that wow that's weird Seven Lakes nothing absolutely nada seven lakes on the veil let's see if we can find on the veil veil seven lakes on the veil okay so it's not got a space in between so let's do that so 7.6 46 plays so quite highly rated um, let's see if we can get into a round on this course there we go and have any of my friends played this it's not giving me an awful lot here so let's go straight into the next screen <coughs> that's not showing me any friends on here so let's tee off i don't remember playing this one i don't think i've played this before so uh yeah this first tee doesn't ring a bell and i've gotten no no ghost balls on the left hand side there so that would suggest that I haven't played this course before alright let's get going that's a good start if that stays straight that's a very good start 290 yeah so we've got 200 to the flag where is the flag? Wow, this is going to be a okay. cave. Can we get over there? And I think we can. 190, 180, that's 18, 8 yards off that. That should be about right. That wind's blowing slightly in. So let's see if this, how this works. It's going to get over. Yep, yeah, that looks good. Looks very good. Yeah, and the roll is good as well. A little bit of a downhill drop there on the green. That's going to be within seven or eight feet. Nine feet, and we've got a wicked left to right here. Good stuff. Lovely. Nice first hole. Nice first hole. Oh, wow, look at this. really tight all right so eight yards that's three off that so that's 202 it's into the wind let's take a little bit off this can't afford to take too much off it because there's no green to play with got 100 percent that's the main thing that's not if it gets over is it going to stop that's the main thing is it going to roll into that bunker no it's actually stopped Cool. 215. We've got a wicked downhill putt now. Look at that. 14 inches downhill. So this is just going to keep going and going and going. So I just want to get this started, I think. Flattens out a bit down here, so that was okay. Can't grumble about that putt. I'll be happy to just walk away with the par here, which I have done. So I got a three on the first hole, so that was an eagle putt. I didn't even realise that. That's two under already. Right, so where's the flag? It's round this corner. Now, the question is, where does a driver land? There. Can we get over here? Looks far enough away, but it's downhill. I think a three iron is the club. 
On five wood. Five wood. Will it get over though? This is the test. Yeah, that will get over. Will it get down? Now it needs to stop. Now it needs to stop. Oof. Okay, so 84 to 88. I don't think that's going to get there. How much green have we got to play with? Not a lot. Right, I'm going to go a little bit more here. Side hill lie. 94% for power. Not good, but it's over. I'll tell you what. Ooh. Would that be any better if it was a hundred? Mm, I seriously don't think so. So this is for a birdie. Get in! Oh yes! Up and down from there. Beautiful. Alright. Wow, look at this hole, man. This is amazing, this course. Alright. 18 feet off that, so 6 yards, 220. Let's try and take this a bit, try and take it a bit flatter. I don't know, I'm not going to mess around with this. So there's a bit of wind here. Oh man, what do you do? That's not enough. It's a par three. I've got to just hope this stops. There's a bank at the back there, so that is probably what that's for. Yeah, that's definitely what that's for. That needs to keep coming. Keep coming. That's alright. Okay. Looking jet going over there. 28 feet. Is that straight? Dead straight. Get in. Wow. Nice. Four under. Four under through four. Going along well. Alright, we need a driver here. Try and keep this in the fairway. Yeah, lovely and straight. Should be good. And is good. Par 5. So this looks like it goes around to the right, which it does. It's given me the club to go for the green. Yes, it has. 253 downhill. Need to be on the left of this by the looks of it. That's okay. Oh no, 97. Is that going to get up? Yes, it's got up. Oh, this could end up pretty damn good. Wow. So what do we got here? 15 feet left to right for an eagle again. No, I allowed too much. That's alright, we'll pick up the birdie and move on. Cool beans. Alright, nice wide open fairway. Look at this. Five iron. Really? That is a driver taker. Does it get us across? It does. But it's so narrow. got to be the one. That's okay. That's okay. What are we going to have? A decent lie there. Yeah, 91 to 97. 
sandwich. Lob wedge. It's got to be the sandwich. 89. Take a little bit off it. Not a lot. Be the club. That's okay. I can live with that. We're on for two. And that looks fairly flat. A little bit of downhill and it drops for another birdie. This looks like a wicked dog leg right. Yeah, it is. Three iron. Two eighty two there. Oh my god. Okay, so that is why you don't go for that one. Or do you? No, you don't. That's just being stupid. Okay, so we'll get over these trees. Where does the tree would take us? Into the shit. I think that's got to be the club. Yeah, that's the club. That's not going to even hold the fairway at that, is it? Is that on the fairway? Light rough, that's okay. 116, light rough. So that's going to be about bob on. that bank for a minute there. Okay, so this is a tough putt. So that's going to move a lot. And it's downhill. Get in. Oh, 7 under 3, 7. Going along beautifully here. Twenty-one feet downhill, so that's 7 off of that. Wind behind. We want to be on the upper plateau. Take a bit off and make sure. Shit, I pulled that. Make sure we get up on that bank at the back, which we are going to do. So that is way, way, way too long. And this is going to be tough on the way back because if we hit that bank, it's going to roll off the green. So this is going to be a flipping nightmare. And this is a par. Oh my god, and it's coming back. And this is a par 3, so I think I'm going to drop at least one here. Okay, yeah, so that was for par. And that is for bogey. So bogey, first bogey of the round, going along beautifully, and I've gone and dropped back to six under now. And this guy really does like his hills. Right, I want to try and bring this around this corner a bit. A bit. That's okay, because that's going to be on the top of that hill. Oh my god, look at this! Par 5. I'll take that. I'll take that any day. 
It's on the green for two on a par five. So I've got this for an eagle, but it is miles away. 71 feet. This is just getting it close, I think. Which it's now hit a bank and it's rolling away. All right, so that was for eagle. Oh, really? Really? Come on! So now I've got an even harder putt. Why is it giving me? That's not 68 feet. The hole's not even there. Right, so that to me looks about 30 feet, but it's 39 uphill. And that was for par. Sorry, that was for birdie. So now this is for par. So it's gone from being an eagle putt to a par save. Which we managed to get. Wow, that was a tough, tough hole. Six under through nine. Oh, what a convenient place to put a bridge. Alright, it's downhill, so this should roll up to that river, stream, whatever it is. As long as it doesn't go in the stream. Beautiful. See, another par 5. 282. Uphill, so let's bring it over here. Because that looks like there's a little bit of a gap there. Let's drop a club down. Yeah. Or should we? No, let's go. Balls out because that's going to be hitting that bank, I would imagine. Yeah. And that should, yeah, it should roll back down. A little bit further up, not an awful lot. And this 10 feet shouldn't make an awful lot of difference here. So what we want to try and do is take a bit off of this so it doesn't skip forward. Yeah, that'll do. So we've got a birdie putt here. Tough one as well. Nope, missed that. Okay, another par. Right, so that's nowhere near where the green is. Where's the green? Down there. Three ninety six to the flag. We can get there. With that wind behind, I can get there. No shadow of a doubt. Beautiful. I could have, yeah, yeah. That would have been a tough one because that's. This is the angle you want on this green because of the tree there. So 61 into the wind, downhill. It's got to be the club. A little bit of roll. Going to leave myself a birdie putt at least. Downhill, left to right. Slow down. Ah. Wow, look at this for narrow. Holy cow. Three wood into the wind. That's staying straight, is it? It's 
from the first cut by the looks of it. Light rough, yeah. But can we get to this green? Three iron, mm, out of this rough. Seriously doubt it. So let's aim for the skinny bit of fairway or green that's over there. Allow for this wind. And that came out really sideways so that should end up in that bunker yeah just rolled in so we should have a decent line here mind you it's on the down slope let's see if we can get this close no that's not close at all and that was for bloody birdie so i'm gonna have a monster putt for par here 36 feet. Oof, not a million miles away, but it's another drop shot. So we've gone from having an eagle, a par, and then I think, let's have a count. An eagle, a par, five birdies on the bounce, to then two bogeys and two pars. No. Two bogeys and three pars in one hole. What is that there? A pile of stones? <laughs> it's like a Mayan type thing going on over there. Um, where does the driver take us? Mm, into danger, I think. It's got to be the three wood, I think. Yeah. Should be safe. checked up on that little bank so that's going to give me a good shot into the green from here 100 yards uphill wind behind so that's all going to cancel itself out should do anyway that is going to be pretty good if that stops yes should be able to get one of those shots back now Okay, back to six under. Pleased with that. After a couple of bad holes, loving this course. This course is nice. And those bunkers are properly in play here. We do not want to be too right. And is that going to carry those bunkers? Yes, it is. That's okay. Par five. Still got 270 yards to go. Holy cow, do we go for this? Yes, we do. Got the wind behind me, so I've got to go for it. I need a good roll here now. Oh, it's going to give me a beautiful eagle putt here. Wow, nice. Ah, tough eagle putt though. Get in. Mm, yes. So that should be, yeah, that was recouped all those uh, drop shots from earlier. Let's see if I can keep it together here now. 169, 18 feet, so that's 6 on top of that, so 176 into the wind. Take a couple of, in, couple of feet off that. Let's hit this, and it looks like I've pulled it a bit, pushed it a bit. That's going to be okay, stop. Come around a bit. Twenty-three feet moving left to right quite a bit. Okay. Three to play, two fours and a three, ending on a par three, which is nice into the wind. So I've got to be careful here because that driver could get to those pot bunkers. 
What do I do? Do I? It's a short par four, so I'm going to play a three wood. Keep it safe, I think. No. Wow. That's right in the bottom of the bunker. So hopefully I can get out from there. And it rolled in. So I should be okay. Should be, I say. Let's see if we can... That came out nice. Is it going to stop on the green though? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That was definitely 98%. Okay, so we've got a tough little cut here. Turn, turn. Oh! Roll a couple of feet past the flag. In for par. Wow, look at this. This is awesome, this course. That's five wood. That's three wood. That's driver. The driver can get over here with the wind behind. I'm pretty damn sure of it. That's going to be in the bunker. Or is it? No. No. It's going to stay out. Awesome. Fairway. Can we get over this hump though? 172. Wind behind. So I need to drop that down. Let's see if that gets there. Should do. That's going to be left of the flag. Hugely on the green so what have we got downhill seven inches down I've got to be careful here this doesn't run too far past it's going to keep going this one didn't go as much as I thought still went 21 feet but mm, didn't roll as much as I thought it would Last hole. Ah, look at that. Seven, seven lakes on the veil. SOTD. Brilliant. Brilliant. Lovely stuff. Like it a lot. 36 feet, 12. I'm going to play this club because we've got into the wind. Is the five wood too much? Five wood's too much. Sorry, three wood's too much. Is that going to be short? Yeah, and it's going to be plugged. Bang! 45 to 65, so a little better chance. So let's bang this out. See if it comes out clean, which it has done. So unless I can sink this, which is highly unlikely, I'm going to bogey the last. Yeah, so drop to seven under. So round of seven under, that gives me a nice solid 65, and that includes three bogeys. So not too unhappy with that. Um, can't see any scores here. Sort by friends. Let's have a look. Public. Best score minus one. Wow. That average. Dogs bollocks. Longest scoring shot. Longest scoring putt. Greens in regulation. Average driving distance. We should be quite high up on this leaderboard. I'm going to give that a nice solid 8 because I enjoyed that. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please press the like button, leave any comments if you'd like to see any particular courses 
or you've got anything to say about the video or the course I thought it was a pretty cool course if you haven't subscribed please hit the subscribe button in the beginning of the video and I will see you on the next round where I'm going to play another recommended course thanks for watching guys see you later bye